I'm Brianne Springstead. I'm Raquel Beckford. I'm Kelly McNaughton. I'm Keelan LeBerry. We are the Raymond Hat Patterson Scholarship winners. I'm a senior or rising senior at Trinity College in Hartford, Connecticut, and I can't believe I'm actually saying that. Time is going by so fast, and I think that I've learned so much, but I kind of need to sit back and reflect on it because it's gone just that fast. And I think just being here at this scholarship luncheon for the last time is kind of sad because it means I'm on my way to my next journey. I agree also, being a senior is scary and it's weird because that means I'm going to be in the real world soon, but having this scholarship, having all the opportunities I've gotten because of it have really helped me become the person I am and helped me understand the kind of things I want to do even if I don't know the type of job I want yet. It's still, it provides a lot of clarification It was because it was less to worry about money-wise and stuff. It was more about finding myself and my classes and what I like to do. Um, working here has given me so much confidence as I went into college that I didn't even knew that I would need. Just like my organizational skills and everything and being able to talk to anybody and just like even like not even like the legal side of it because I did learn a lot about that but just like learning how to be in an office and like talk to people it's really important to me. I just returned from studying abroad in Barcelona um, in the beginning of May, which is an opportunity that I would not even have imagined if it weren't for the scholarship. Um, it just helped so much. I, it didn't cost much more than just a regular semester. Um, and just even knowing that I, because of the scholarship too, like I, I do have the possibility because to go um, for, like for further school and graduate school, whether it's graduate school, law school, whatever, I do have that um, option with the scholarship. Um, and now I'm back working here again in the transactional department, um, working with Rosemary and her paralegal Fay. Um, and even I was a business manager for um, a soccer training franchise. And had I not had this internship here, I wouldn't have been able to take on something like that in my freshman and sophomore year of college. Okay, so working here, um, thinking about it now, actually, like looking back at the amount of time that's passed and me now going into my junior year as a computer programming major, the, I learned the, like how to handle workloads better because if I didn't work here, I wouldn't have known exactly, exactly what I was capable of as far as handling large amount of workloads and time consuming things and how to get it done in an efficient time period. And it's definitely an important skill, especially for my major to have, being that there's always deadlines and there's a lot of big projects that come about. So it's definitely helped me a lot. Working here gave me um, a lot of experience that a lot of people my age didn't have going into college. I already had an internship, and a lot of people that I knew, they didn't have any experience, so I had a lot of experience in the real world. And because of the scholarship, I also didn't have to worry about a lot of things that my friends had to worry about, like money and finances. And just like Jennifer, I just came back from France, and I didn't have to worry about anything. Um, well, I consider myself so lucky to have like met Adam and gotten the opportunity to work here because it was truly life-changing because just to have that connection and he has so many connections that um, it's really amazing and just to hear him say that like I did a good job or like he likes what I'm doing now is really just shows me that I'm on the right path and I really look to him so much for that kind of support so it's amazing. Mm -hmm. I think when like when um, I found out that I was going to have this internship um, like I thought it was really cool but like I didn't realize that it would be like it's seriously one of the best decisions I've ever made and I just think it's incredible how Adam just he's continued to just give and give and when you think he can't give anymore he's giving like three times as more like look how many of us now and then there's all of the people that graduated so um, I just like while you're working here it's just such a great group of people but you don't realize that afterwards like they like especially Adam would like drop anything when I was I was waitlisted at University of Pennsylvania. He like bent over backwards to try to get me in and I still didn't get in and he's still regretful about that. But like I'm just so grateful and he had other attorneys here trying to help me who just everyone just whatever.
I agree. I think that taking the internship, it was like, you didn't know how much more was going to come out of it than just an internship. And like having someone there for career advice is great because I regularly panic about what I'm going to do <laughs> in my life. So it's really nice having someone to go to if I do freak out about my future. I agree. And I also think that Adam is very honest. Yes. <laughs> um, he's very honest and he does not hold back in giving <laughs> honest advice. And so you can take that with a grain of salt. But um, I appreciate his honesty because there are many people who will tell you, yeah, go ahead and do that. Like, jump over that, you know, jump off, jump off that bridge when you know that something um, detrimental is behind it. But I think that behind his honesty is good intention, and that's very important. So I appreciate that. Um, well, I can't even begin to think about how different my life would be if I didn't get this internship. Because when I first got it, it was like, okay, now, you know, I have something to do while I'm in school. And then... It turned into me staying the whole year and throughout the summer and it's like okay like you know i like working here everybody's like very supporting and helpful and everything and then when you actually get the scholarship and you graduate and you're in college and you're actually looking at like the people around you and you're hearing about like their long situation and everything like that it's like the scholarship is really like it's it's really it like she said it's life-changing because it makes everything so much like it takes such a big load off you to not have to worry about paying loans off and everything and you can like think about further plans as far as like okay when i graduate i know i won't have x amount of loans to pay back so now what can i really like what do i really want to do in my life do i want to go straight to graduate school do i want to work for a little bit and then go into graduate school like you have that cushion to just yeah. stop and think about what you really want to do like after you graduate and like i'm going into my junior year and that's all I'm thinking about right now. Like, what do I really want to do when I graduate? Like, and I, it's good that I could even come back to Adam and say, like, you know, I want to find an internship. Like, can you help me? And he's like, yeah, I have a million connections. I can. And then you can just something as simple as hearing the different stages that he went through in his life and being able to make it like a list of goals for yourself. Like, okay, he did this at this age, then maybe I should be doing this around the same age to reach the same level of success or even higher. Yeah, I agree. I feel like I don't know how my life would have been if I wasn't here. Like, I feel like it would be very different because coming here, this was my first work experience before working here. Like, I've applied to many places like Visa and things like that. But once I got here, I feel like this set the standard for everything else that I did because to this day, I have never worked in retail. Every job that I've had to this day has been office work. And I feel like that's such an amazing thing. And Adam really takes you under his wing because when I was applying to college, he was the one that helped me, wrote recommendations for me. And he helped me get into Syracuse, which was the school he ended up going to, so.